What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. This is another Wax Party Break, guys. This is Jaspies Hip Parade Multisport Madness Dual Case Break. Three random teams each, number 10. And again, guys, last two cases of the print run. 20 total boxes, of course, 20 hits. Probably have pulled most of these, but there still could be a chance of a couple of these still hiding here, of course. Now, usually there's at least one of these in every case. Now, of course, there's more cases than what was shown here, right? So there was a couple previews that are probably not shown that we did pull, but at least these ones here were like the main big ones probably. So, of course, it's a three random teams break. So, of course, it's multi-sport. We're going to have football, basketball, and baseball. So 30 total spots. Everybody gets a random team in the NFL, MLB, and NBA. Now we're going to combo up two teams in the NFL, of course, because they have 32. It's going to be Commanders, Raiders, Texans, Cardinals. So what we're going to do here, guys, this dice roll is going to be for the list of names. And we'll paste it in. And then we're going to do the randomizers here, right? So you're going to stay in the same position for each sport. NFL, MLB, and then, of course, NBA. All right? In that order. So let's click dice roll. It is a 4 and a 4, 8 the hard way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 times. 8, 8. Donna at the top, Donna Andrew at the bottom. 8-8. Eight, eight. Now again, I'm going to paste your names in here. It's the same thing for each one, guys. So NFL, MLB, NBA. All right. So now, with the same dice row eight times, we're going to go with the NFL first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Atlanta Falcons down to the Cleveland Browns. All right. And then I'll, I'll let you look at these a little bit later. Let's go on to the next one, of course. MLB, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cardinals down to the Braves. Let's go eight times here. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. Pelicans out of the Spurs. All right, so now I'm going to, you know, I'm not going to go through every single name. It's just a lot of names and too many teams to say out loud. But I'll give you a quick minute or so to look at each one. So just as the way it came out right there, of course, with Donald with the Falcons, all the way down to Andrew with the Browns. What I'm going to do is I'm going to alphabetize it, of course. All right, make it look nice. And then I'll give you like a quick minute to see your teams. Now, you could make trades. A lot of people really don't. But if you want to make a trade, you can only make it within the same sport. So you can't trade like the Arizona Cardinals for the, you know, Arizona Diamondbacks, right? You know, got to keep it football, football. So... There's the names of the teams there. I'll give you guys a quick minute and then we'll move on to the next one. Yeah, Jimmy wants to trade the Broncos, so if anybody else is interested, trading one of their NFL teams. All right, well, in the meantime, you can, the trade window will still be open. Let's move on to the next sport. So, again, same thing here. I'm going to show you guys the way it came out. All right, from the Cardinals down to the Braves. But let me alphabetize and make it look nice. And then, of course... You guys can look at your teams really quick and see if there's a potential trade for one of you guys there.
All right, let's go on to the next one. All right, again, so Pelicans down to the Spurs. So there's the teams there. All right, Jimmy. I don't know if anybody's going to want to make any trades, so. Try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. Let's go. All right, guys. So let's close it. All right, so here we go. So there's that one. There's that one. And here's this one. So case 5 of 20 is the last one here. And then the other case looks like it's 9 of 20. We got the Big Hurt, Frank Thomas. That's from Top Supreme, 22 out of 32 for the Chicago White Sox. Now, again, White Sox is over here, and that's Brian Kordick. There you go. Brian K. Next one. And usually the way the configuration was, there's at least three hits for each sport in a case, and then one extra for, for another sport. So one sport should have four for the most part. At least that's what I've been seeing. 
You got Amonra St. Brown, a little patch autograph from Origins Football. That one is not numbered, but of course that's going to go to the uh, Detroit Lions, which is C Curtis, right? Yeah, Curtis, there you go. We got Chris Olave, patch autograph from Obsidian. That is numbered 66 out of 175. Saints is Andrew. Andrew C. There you go. On the board there, buddy. Why are you saying go Dodgers for Rex? Because you need the Dodgers to win. For your cubby sake. And we got a little Austin Reeves for the Lake Show. Resign with the Lakers. Lakers, that is going to Brian K. There you go. Another one for you, buddy. We got Larry Walker for the Colorado Rockies. 19 out of 25. Karen Steele on the board. We got Bam Adebayo. That's actually probably a rookie. It should be. Nice one there for the Heat. Go ahead, Craig. got a Jeremy Pena rookie autograph number to 75 and that graded a 9 autograph 10 that is actually one of the sell sheet hits I believe Houston Astros Brian K but the other Brian K not Cordic Oh, there's a couple of Brian's right there. That was Houston Astros. And we got Laurie Markinen. Autographed to 99. That's from Noir Basketball. Chicago Bulls. Bulls is Melissa Turner. Then we have a Bryson or Grayson Rodriguez, sorry. That is 16 to 25, 25 for Baltimore Orioles. Jimmy on the board.
last one before the next case. We have a Ray Lewis. Nice patch autograph from Panini Black Gold Football. One out of 49. And of course, Ravens. Will Brockton. There you go. Next one. Nice. O'Neal Cruz. Cruz. And I believe that's another sell sheet. I think he's still injured, right? He got injured early this season, but obviously a lot of people are high on this kid. And 73 out of 99. The new Cruz right now is Ellie Little Cruz, but very nice uh, Topps Chrome Green for the Pirates. Or a PSA 9 refractor autograph to 99. And of course, Pirates is Jimmy. How about that, Jimmy? Huh? That helps right there. Pittsburgh Pirates for you, buddy. Next one. We have a little Ray Allen. That looks like an autograph, right? Yeah, it's hiding right there. That is uh, when he was a, a Buck, I think, right? Looks like he's wearing a Bucks jersey. So Ray Allen, this is what? Two, 1998. Yeah. 1998 press group. That's crazy. So Milwaukee Bucks. I know. That's how he got injured, right, Jimmy? Like, I think he was sliding and then, like, what, did he tear his knee up or was it, like, his leg? I have a feeling it was his knee, though, right? Um, so, yeah, the Ray Allen is Bucks. And uh, where's basketball? Steve Kendrick. There you go. Good question, Rex. Good question. Um, I love it all, man. I love chicken. I love beef. I love pork. But probably... I could only eat one? I mean, obviously, if I could only eat meat for the rest of my life, like beef, it's probably bad for me, right? Pork is probably really bad for me, too. Probably have to juice chicken, man, honestly. I mean, I actually probably eat more chicken than any of those, but I love, obviously, meat and then pork. We have a Yardon Alvarez Gold Stars, PSA 10 rookie for the Astros. Uh, Brian K. Oh, that's right. It was a half slide. You're right. And we got a Barry Larkin that looks like a transcendent to 20. Uh, Cincinnati Reds, going to Andrew C. Yeah, probably. I just feel like with chicken, I mean, obviously, I can just eat chicken breast the way it is with like rice. I can eat chicken breast, you know, or I, can, I mean, think about it, I can eat like fried chicken, right? 
you know, that's probably bad for me, but eat fried chicken with, like, you know, mashed potatoes and gravy and stuff like that. I can eat chicken with, like, stir-fry, right? I can eat chicken with uh, some, like, chow mein. With, like, pasta, I can eat, like, a chicken parm. But, yeah, I mean, meat's probably could do a little bit more. Chicken, obviously, is just all one thing, right? With, with beef, I, I have, and I have the whole cow. John Stockton. 299 for the Utah Jazz. Karen's deal with the Jazz. I mean, for me, the pork. I mean, obviously, I love carnitas. So that's my favorite. All right. Bacon. We got a CD Lamb RPA from Certified. Thirty one out of thirty five. Dallas Cowboys. James O. Oh. Nice. There you go, man. Oh yeah, Rex. Yeah. I usually just see like grilled chicken, honestly. Grilled chicken with some rice or vegetables, some veggies, some like carrots or broccoli. Whoa! Look at this. This is cool. This is one of those Topps Chrome Minis. This is when uh, Aaron Judge was a prospect. That's awesome. Look at that. Graded a nine five. It was a 10 in there, a couple 9.5s, and corners a 9, but that's pretty cool. 2013 Bowman Chrome Mini, Aaron Judge prospect. And, of course, that is going to go to the Yankees and Brian Corden. Right, we got a Chris Olave patch autograph for the Saints to 99 from Panini Black. Saints, I believe we called the Saints earlier, right? Andrew C. Uh, Michael Bridges. There you go. Phoenix Suns. Jimmy with the Suns. Yeah, that'll do it to you, Rex. I mean, obviously, just try to eat more, more cooked meals rather than, like, processed or frozen, right? Just cutting little things out. I mean, like, I mean, obviously, I feel like if we want to lose the most weight, we probably have to not only eat better, but also work out, right? But... Just cutting out certain foods or drinks, I mean, you can easily lose some weight. That's always the first step, right? And last one here is a nice Najee Harris. Looks like it's a redemption. Little patch autograph. RPA to 99 for the Steelers. Steelers. That is Donald with the Pittsburgh Steelers. There you go. And there you go, folks. There you go. That was the break. So pretty nice stuff here. So it looks like the last two main sell sheet hits were, of course, the uh, the O'Neill Cruz. And then we had the uh, Jeremy Bank. So a couple of baseballs uh, sell sheet hits there. But other than that, guys, still some very, very nice stuff right here, guys. Appreciate it, guys. Again, this was the last two cases. So now what we're going to do, guys, is give away that uh, little wax party promo spot. All right, so there's all the customer names. Now, again, I think Joe was talking that we were saving some of these here, but, I mean, obviously we already did these, so that wouldn't be there for that.
Yes, and that's the difference for me, Rex. Obviously, I mean, I've always been a big person in general, but I used to obviously lose a lot more weight when I worked out, right? But me, now that I just sit down here at the shop for most of the time, the eating is the is the poor part. But yeah, uh, it's, it's it's tough, man. You, someone you just get used to it. It's a drug, honestly. You know, if you don't, if you don't drink and do do actual drugs, food is a drug, <laughs> especially junk food. All right, so uh, dice roll here. There's the names, of course. Uh, the winner here is gonna get a promo spot, and then uh, let me just put Madness here, number ten. And of course, we got that. And then this is what Wednesday. All right, so here we go, guys. Dice roll it, boom. One and two, three times. One, two, three. Boom, boom, three. Three. And Craig from the Hangar Pack 17. I don't even know if I called your name, Craig. Guinness. Didn't call the Jaguars. Didn't call the Twins. Didn't call the Heat, right? So there you go. Congratulations, man. You did get into that wax party. So there you go, folks. Again, um, that was our last multi-sport madness. We still have more Hip Parade products on the website if you guys are interested. Got that one huge 190 box mixer. And of course, I'm sure we'll post up some more stuff soon. So appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Oh, wait. Yeah, he